Hey guys, welcome to the Showstopper Shows. I'm gonna show you the best way to sear a steak on the Pit Boss, let's go. You wanna turn your grill up as high as it can go, which I have it on high, but it's actually about 600 in here right now. And I'm gonna open it real quick and show you the key. I've taken this extra grate out because I wanna be able to move it. Hey, right here, you see the fire. Now I'm gonna put my steak right on that. We're gonna sear each side. And I have my steak right here and I have it marinating. It's gonna, it's really thick steak. And we're gonna put on there about two minutes on each side. We're gonna get, so we're gonna go ahead and put the steak on here and it's gonna get even, even hotter when I put the steak in here. So here we go, right over the heat. Right there. And we close it. We're gonna wait about two minutes. We're gonna flip it again. And then we're gonna close the grate and then we're gonna let it cook another seven to nine minutes. And that depends on how well you want your steak done. Searing it like this sends all the juice into the middle of the steak. And that way you don't lose the nice juicy flavor of the steak. And then you can cook it as long as you want if you want it more well, but don't overdo it or it will start cooking the juice out of the steak. Watch the grill marks happen right here. All right, so we're gonna go another couple minutes there. And what I'm gonna do is we're gonna put this other grate back on here and I'm gonna slide the cover over the fire bucket of the pit boss and then we're gonna slide them to the side. I'm gonna turn the heat down and let it cook a little bit lower for about, again, like seven to 10 minutes. These are sirloin filets. So these are gonna be amazing. I normally like bone in, but tonight we're going filet. So you see this is open, so I'm gonna close that gate. There we go. And then I'm gonna add this grate back on. What we do is we put the steak right on the side. And you can see there's no juice coming out of the inside of the steak. I'm gonna let that cook just to the side. So we're about three minutes in and I'm gonna hit them with some butter. And this goes, nothing is worse with butter on it, as we all know. And this just keeps the juices inside, gives it a nice flavor. Don't use fake butter, use the real stuff. Time is up, we're gonna go ahead and get these off the grill. Take a look at that. And we're gonna cut them here. We wait about 10 minutes, let that juice sink back in here, and then we're gonna cut these steaks, and I'm gonna show you what they look like. So here it is, we have this sirloin steak right here, filet, and I'm gonna go ahead and we're gonna slice right here, and we're gonna see what it looks like on the inside. First time. Oh yeah, now it's a little, a little more done than I probably would have liked, but you can see it's got the nice pink on the inside and it's not overcooked. It's still very juicy. All the juices sunk into the inside and it is a perfect piece of steak. Yeah, even a little more pink right here. Look at that. And what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna slice that in half and I'm gonna do something all y'all out there salivating to do. Mmm. Mmm. I did some basic steak seasoning, some seasoned salt, and I let that marinate with olive oil for a little bit, about an hour. That is chewy, that is juicy, and not dry in any way. My channel, I do a must or a bust, and that is a must. So we finished slicing that first steak right here as well. And you can see it's even more rare. That one side was just a little bit thinner than this side. This cooked perfectly. As you can see, it's juicy, it's moist, and it looks like it's gonna be the best steak ever. And I'm about to dive in. I still haven't even cut the other one yet, guys. That is a steak and that's how it's done on the Pit Boss. Guys, this is perfect. It tastes amazing. It has a great smoky grilled flavor and I recommend trying it out. If you try this out, let me know if you have any more tips or tricks. I'm always open to those too, but I found this works best for me on my Pit Boss. Thank you for watching the Showstopper Shows. If you don't already, please subscribe. Follow me on my Instagram and my Facebook page as well. Thank you so much. May the force be with you. May his presence be with you always. The show stops here.
Never quit, y'all. Never quit. <laughs>